Look at Megan's tan line from yesterday. It's a frickin' train track. Today is unfortunately my last full day here on the island of St. Martin. Everyone else is here for like another week, but because of school, I gotta go back tomorrow. So, what better way to make the most out of this day than a fall island tour? You forgot this. Bye. <laughs> Chicken? There's something over there. There's a chicken in there somewhere. I'm just slowly starting to realize how much of an actual like tourist tool I look like tank top of the name of the place I'm at, sunglasses, the really cheesy tourist hat, the iPhone and a selfie stick. If I'm not the definition of stereotypical tourist, I don't know what is. Number two. All right, stop number three. about this beach. This beach is also famous for being a clothing optional beach. So you could say that there is a fair amount of older people who should probably be putting something on. And that something on is not just sunscreen. This is literally the exact same place we were at the other night where there was all the parade, that massive steel band, steel drum band, and that amazing Caribbean dinner. This is the exact same place during the day. Practically empty. And stop number. Stop number five. <laughs> I think so, yeah. <laughs> As I was doing that, the guy just yelled out selfie. Back here again because I really want some mini donuts to take home. <laughs> Alright, I got my diabetes in a bag. Off to our last stop of this little tour. <laughs> And a 
our last stop of this tour, Mullet Beach. St. Martin never fails to amaze me. Mullet Beach, thanks. With this being my last day here in St. Martin, there's only one thing to do. Let's go to the swim up bar. All right, I'll buy you a drink. What was that? I'll buy you a drink. Score. We literally have the entire family at the bar. If that's not goals, I don't know what is. There we go. Thank right, you. Ready? Cheers. Whoops. Yeah, stay family alive. cheers. That's okay. Family cheers. cheers. Love you all. Thank you so much for coming with me this year. Thank you. So because this is my last night here, dinner is my choice. So we're going to a highly acclaimed seafood restaurant, literally just across the road from our hotel. I'm kind of excited because I've been wanting seafood the entire time I've been here. This should be good. So we're just chilling here at a table. And those lights you see, those are the eyes of some massive fish, like at least four feet long. Of course in the Caribbean, you gotta get an authentic Caribbean lobster. I'm going to choose my own lobster for them to grill. That's pretty impressive. Look at these bonkers. These things are massive. Look at eyes. They're like bigger than you. I know, right? Let's go this one, maybe. There we go. That is what I like to call dinner. That is the bad boy right there. That one right there. About to go on my plate. Thank you. Oh my word. Can I take a lime? Look at this. That looks delicious. Oh my. Just look at the size of this thing. Like this thing's bigger than my face. That is delicious. That was the best lobster I've ever had in my entire life. Now that's safe to say that's been destroyed in every possible way. All in all, I give Lee's Roadside Grill a solid thumbs up. That was delicious.